Mandalorians. Trained from birth to fight in battle, their bodies are honed into killing machines. These independent warrior nomads have challenged the Jedi for centuries. The Mandalorians embrace conflict and admire strength, but they are different from our dark counterparts. They are not like the Sith. Mandalorians believe confrontation is required for growth on the personal as well as the cultural level. War is the Mandalorian way of life. Combined with their thirst for conquest, it makes them undeniably dangerous. However, we must acknowledge that their commitment to self-improvement is not unlike our own. And there's even something respectable about their rugged sense of honor. But they are not our friends. The Mandalorian's allegiance to our enemies has cost us dearly. After the Sith Empire's initial onslaught, star systems continue to fall, until the Jedi finally managed to stop the enemy's advance in the mid-rim. For the first time in decades, the Republic Senate breathed a sigh of relief. But it was short-lived. In the arenas of Geonosis, a young gladiator had risen to prominence, calling himself the New Mandalore, a title unclaimed for centuries, a title reserved for the greatest warrior in the galaxy, a warrior worthy to lead the Mandalorians. Though it had been centuries, the descendants of the once proud culture had not forgotten the legends of the Mandalores who had gone before. Spread far and wide, working as mercenaries and bounty hunters, when the new Mandalore called, his loyal subjects came. Mandalore's call was simple, to confront the galaxy's greatest challenge and fight the legendary knights of the Jedi Order. Amassing an army overnight, Mandalore planted his forces in the path of the Hydean Way trade route, cutting off the Republic's most critical supply lines. We were initially hesitant to pull back from the battle with the Sith in the Outer Rim, but after several pleas from the Senate, the supply crisis could not be ignored. The Jedi Order answered the new Mandalore's challenge. We attacked the blockade. Our order was defeated quite profoundly. The Mandalorian blockade held strong until the day intrepid smugglers took their shot at the Mandalorians and managed to rescue the Republic. Mandalore went on to lead many of his followers to seek new challenges, while others again struck out on their own. The true enigma in the resurgence of the Mandalorians was the rise of the new Mandalore himself. I will endeavor to find clues to this enigma for my next report.